underneath the Hayes van, I pulled out this little plug from right here to drain the radiator fluid. So that's how you change the radiator fluid in your Hayes van, 2006 model on this one. I'm gonna flush the distilled water through it, also to help wash it out because uh, someone put some green antifreeze in here and it's supposed to be pink and those two mix together cannot be good. Uh, sometimes they gel up and create more problems on flushing out the radiator. Pulled off the cap for intake and releasing the rest of the fluid now. Uh, there's a vacuum pull keeping some of it in. Then I'll try and dispose of the liquid properly, uh, put it back into the containers I refill with later to uh, throw away, keep it sealed. Here's the, the radiator intake fluid. I haven't found like a traditional style cap like in other vehicles with a radiator. I just have this this container to fill up with the radiator fluid on that high span. Just pop pop the hood. Right under there. Give the engine fluid. Now I'm just putting just the distilled water in here. I'm gonna turn, turn the engine on with that, let it run through the engine a little bit, then drain that, and then put the actual antifreeze back in. See how much this takes? I think it's supposed to be about 10, 10 and a half liters for this system. Um, it's an 8 liter bottle I put. change your search to Hilux or show you results for the Hilux but not the high ace um, so even finding the radiator fluid capacity is difficult and I'm not even sure if that there's other variables so I don't even know if that 10 and a half is correct or not Draining again. I'm gonna 
put pour just a little bit more in there, and then I'm gonna, I'm gonna flush the rest, put the plug back in, and fill it up with the fluid. And I'm just gonna refill with this, refill through here with a little funnel. Refill that radiator and then you're gonna seal up. So only a little bit of fluid came out when I drained it. Uh, popped off the cap on top again and it emptied a bit and so I ended up adding another uh, two liters and filled it back up so um, I ran it a little bit to try to get some fluid through the engine but ended up taking uh, about eight liters of fluid um, to refill. Alright, so hopefully that will help you change the radiator fluid on your own if you get the chance. It's not super hard. Um, and way, help you out. Super noisy around here. I'm trying to get the video as best I can here. Alright, thank you.